Hey guys, good morning. We're in southern Indiana today, and we're stopping to check out the Battle of Cordon historic site. And this is the only Civil War battle that happened in Indiana. It was General John Morgan who marched north along this road in, on July 9, 1863. Now, the Confederacy had to launch about three to four separate uh, attacks that were all withheld um, from, by the Hoosiers. But then ultimately, the Confederates went back and got uh, some more reserves from back in Kentucky and then were able to overpower and run out the Hoosiers. The Hoosiers went to retreat and were chased by the Confederacy and only about 100 of the 450 Hoosier men were able to escape. Now this is on the National Register of Historic Places. And right here it's a memorial park. Pretty cool. The mooring post and anchor chain recovered from the Alice Dean steamer sunk by General Morgan after crossing the Ohio River on July 8, 1863. That's pretty cool, guys. A little piece of history here. Wow. So this must be kind of a recreation of what one of the tents looked like. Huh. Interesting. And now we have uh, an old cannon here. I wonder what this building is. Now the main reason the Hoosiers finally retreated wasn't just because all of the cavalry, because they did have some defenses uh, that they put in place the night prior here, but what it really was, was because of all the artillery that the Confederacy brought uh, for that final attack. And it just kind of scared away the Hoosiers. and most of the Hoosiers ended up being captured. Now look at this, old historic house here. Very cool. Interesting. Oh, well, that would have been nice to be able to take a peek and see what's inside here. Hmm. The battleground of Corridon in southern Indiana. Cool piece of history from the Civil War. Didn't realize there was uh, something like this in this area.